Jersey Sports Zone State Championship football coverage is being brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. I'm Mike Frankel at Rutgers for the Group 3 State Championship game between Old Japan and Delcy. Either the Golden Knights or the Crusaders are going home with the first state title in state history. First quarter, Old Japan on the move after a Delcy turnover. Tommy Caracciolo connects with Jack Diggins, and the senior has a first down and more. Diggins powering his way down to the one yard line. First and goal, Golden Knights. Caracciolo can take it from there. The senior punches it in, and OT grabs a 7-0 lead. The Crusaders strike back early in the second quarter. Wayne Adair on the move to the far sideline, into the end zone from six yards out. Delsey ties the game at seven. Old Tapan hits a field goal late in the second, but elects to take it off the board after a roughing the kicker call gives the Knights a first down. The decision pays off. Caracciolo to Aiden Heaney for a touchdown. Heaney over 100 yards rushing in this one as well. 14-7 Old Tapan at the break. Third quarter, here come the Crusaders. Jared Shoppy breaks off a big run. The senior moving the sticks and more. Finally down inside the five, first and goal, Delsey. Then Shoppy finishes the job. Jared Shoppy in for the score. And we are all tied up at 14. Same score, just under seven minutes to go in the fourth. A Golden Knights drive stalls, but OT brings in Nico Ottomanelli to attempt a 46-yard field goal. And Ottomanelli drills it. The junior puts Old Tapan back on top. So Delsey looking for a drive to answer. Instead, this pass is tipped and then intercepted. Andrew Pincus with the pick. And Old Tapan has possession again. Four and a half to go now. Old Tapan facing fourth down from the Delsey 30. Caracciolo out of the game at halftime with an injury. In steps Alex Orecchio. And what a pass here to Evan Brooks for the touchdown. Brooks hauls it in for a 30-yard strike. A dagger for the Golden Knights as Old Tapan captures the first Group 3 state championship. 24-14 the final. An unlikely hero emerges in Orecchio as OT celebrates with the hardware in the rain at Rutgers. I mean, we're always prepared, no matter the, no matter what happens. You know, anyone gets hurt, we're prepared. I mean, it means a lot. You know, we always, we, we grind every day, day and night. We grind, it means a lot for us. It started last week, or not two weeks ago, actually. After we beat West Morris, you know, we knew we were going to see the same type of team, and we just got to work immediately. No days off. The way the whole game played out, and for us to step up in those situations, make big plays, We've, we've played really well, but this is the first time we lost a game, but this is the first time we've been tested where it's like, put it to us, we got our quarterback out, our run game wasn't working great, they had some, they're a great football team, and we had some obstacles and had to go to second, third options, and uh, to step up and do it, and obviously the second quarterback, that's, that's a true test of a team, and to win a game like this, you gotta be a team, you can't be individual, so that's it. So an unforgettable night for the Golden Knights. Old Tapan, the first Group 3 state champion. Both teams finished the season at 12 and 1. At Rutgers, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.